Man, somebody didn't call me. I done seen, and so I'm staying off, staying off my, my social devices. It's too much cooning and buffooning. Too much cooning and buffooning. And believe, and believe me, when I get my thoughts together, I'm going to figure out a way to articulate myself. Because this conversation ain't even for the whole world to hear. It's just for us. Believe me, they saying you cooning and buffooning. Oh, believe me. And they loving every minute of it. I'm telling y'all today, I ain't got the time. I ain't got the time. I ain't got the time. If it ain't about going up, but about being positive, about getting some money and loving God, I ain't got too much coonery, buffoonery going on. The culture's getting killed. I'm not even saying nothing about it because I'm just so burnt out. I will be saying something about it. I'm, I'm, I'm in amazement on what's going on in the world. But hey, who am I? I am somebody, but even I get tired of this, man, woo, it's too much cooning and buffooning, y'all, too much, and we all guilty of it, because, but, but damn, man, I can't believe this is what hip-hop has become, man, I just can't, my, my mind is like blown, man, so y'all need to watch some documentaries on hip-hop, people don't even know what hip-hop is. Netflix has this great documentary on hip hop, the history of hip hop. I know, um, I think Steve Stout did one. Fat Five, Five, Five. Just go to go to YouTube, man. Go to YouTube, man. And I'm not one to cast no stone, but damn it, I know when to stop. So I just wish everybody luck and positive energy. I know this is going way over some people's heads. We gonna end it like this, Lord. Please, Lord, just, just, just bless us to understand the power that we have as cultural leaders out here to send out these positive vibes and energy.